Also, one my foundation stippling brush was like not even in my foundation cup. It was like on the floor on my rug across the room. The ghost in my house be tripping, y'all. They be bugging. Yeah. All you self-promoters are janky We established like the Yankees This whole fucking game thankless We moving militant but somehow you the one tanking No limit to why I could take it And you know me as a Chris Bottle sender Hello guys, it's Naira Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel If you've been here before What's up? I don't have earrings on! Today I'm really excited to be filming uh, Get ready with me for a date night We are going to Ruth Chris Some fancy dining tonight um, and so yeah, I'm really excited about it. We have reservations at 7 and I'm starting to get ready now because we're driving to a different part of our state. Um, I live in North Carolina, so if you're familiar, I live in Fayetteville, in the middle of nowhere. And we're driving to Riley to go to Ruth Chris and we're gonna go to a mall because Fayetteville like literally has no good malls. We have one mall here that is like mad whack, like even the Forever 21 is whack, like that's how you know something's off. So yeah, I'm really excited! I hope I can do some shopping and get a cute little haul out to y'all, but yeah, I'm really excited. So let's just get ready. Okie dokie, so I want to do like a brown, pretty kind of smoky eye. I haven't done a brown smoky eye in a minute. So I'm going to, I want it like, like brown and like brick red type. So I'm going to, why am I about to jump into eyeshadow? Like I don't do my brows first. I don't care about doing like foundation first or brows first. Really, like I don't care that much anymore. But I have to have brows done before my eyeshadow because the brows shapes my eyes, you know? See, it's interesting because brows for me are a mess. I need to pluck my brows desperately. I do my own eyebrows because I know exactly how I like them. I don't want to pay anyone and have any guessing games. I know exactly how I like my brows, so I do my own brows. But it's like, if I'm my own brow lady, I'm really slacking. Also, one my foundation stippling brush was like not even in my foundation cup. It was like on the floor on my rug across the room the ghost in my house be tripping y'all they be bugging all right so boom we're gonna take the instant age rewind conceal my brows prime my lids and have fun i know my hubby is downstairs like what is going on up there oh no no he being loud too it's okay he downstairs being loud I will be using the James Charles Morphe palette and I prime with concealer even though that's not advised but I do set my prime with the LA Girl Pro powder and I think maybe because I'm setting the prime with powder that is what helps like you know me get such good results okay I'm gonna take the shade 10% off that's such a funny name I'm taking shades 10% off and boutique and I'm going to build that up in my crease now I think this is worth mentioning um, I've only said it a few times so if I tell you guys I'm taking two colors and I'm building them up in my crease I never double up colors on a brush I feel like it just makes it look muddy and I don't like two colors like dipping I feel like I'm like mixing the colors around that stresses me out because makeup is expensive and yes I was that kid who didn't want the white crayon to get dirty in kindergarten yes that was me so I'm gonna pick up the first shade apply it and blend it then pick up the second shade oh my gosh guys so we are going on vacation September 14th through September 21st we're going to Dominican Republic St. Thomas and the Virgin Islands Turks and Caicos and San Juan Puerto Rico Oh my God, I'm so excited. All I wanna do is travel and have fun and we're going on vacation together and I am just like over the moon about it. Like I'm so excited. I'm doing another cruise and people really seem to enjoy my, um, my cruise vlogs. I vlogged in, I wanna say Bahamas and Dominican Republic the last time I traveled. This time I wanna vlog Erwear. 
for my vlog everywhere. I'm like so excited about it. I absolutely can't wait. I feel like it's gonna be beautiful. I'm gonna be on islands and beaches during the day. Turn it up in the club at night. It's like, what more could you ask for? I'm so excited. Also, let me tell y'all, I ended up going, instead of going one, two, I ended up going one, two, three by accident because I wasn't paying attention, but it still looks fine, so I'm just going to blend. Okay, for my lids, I want to do something shimmery, so I want to take a, like, a really thick concealer as a base so that I really get that good shimmer up in there. I'm going in with my NYX Conceal Correct Contour Camo, this cream contour palette by NYX. Okay, um, I'm gonna put lashes on off camera. I feel like this eye is so pretty. Oh my God. Like I'm going to like an award show or something. That's kind of what this eye looks like. I'm going to put lashes on off camera. I'll be back and we're gonna do face makeup. It's gonna be fun, promise. Now we're going to take my favorite foundation. Okay, my favorite foundation is the Milani Concealer Perfect, but I was thinking about using the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop, Rockefeller, Rockefeller. We get down, baby. We get Okay, I really don't care if this is TMI because like a lot of my channel is like based around TMI. But today is the first day of my period, so everything is getting on my nerves. And I left my spray bottle in the bathroom, so I just had to get up to wet my beauty blender. And I hate cold water, so I try to wet my beauty blender with the hot water. And then my faucet is taking all long to start heating up the water. And so now my beauty blender is like damp and kind of cold, and I'm over it. I'm gonna cream contour. This came into my life and changed the game for me. This is the e.l.f. cream contour palette. Eh. This shade is deep enough for me, and I think this one might be, but I just haven't really tried it because I like the un like the red undertone of this. I'm going into this pretty little peachy blush right here. I think it's gonna go so good with this eye look. And cream blush is usually like the one for me because I love blush, I'm obsessed with blush, I'm a blush fanatic. And so cream blush is like really pigmented and like allows me to pack it on. With powder blush, I gotta act like I got some scent at some point and stop. But cream blush allows me to put on a bunch and then go, oh, I didn't notice it was gonna be this pigmented because it's cream and then blend it out and I can look as stupid as I want with as much blush as I want. And a lot of you in my comments be like, oh my God, you told you said in one of your videos, just put on a bunch of blush one day and like see how much you like it. And y'all were like, it's true. Like people that were like, I usually don't wear any blush. And then I watched your video and you said that I should try put wearing more blush and but yes. Uh, I think blush was made for brown girls. It is beautiful. I think blush on melanated skin is beautiful. Obviously blush on all skin is beautiful, but a lot of brown girls are discouraged from trying blush because it doesn't come in their shades. It's unfortunate we have to look a little harder and hopefully one day it won't be like that for us to have to dig so hard for a blush that's good for our skin tone. But when you find it, baby girl, it will change your face. I promise. I want to thank each and every one of you for watching. You make my heart beat. You make me happy. It makes me so happy when people watch and enjoy my videos. I know I sound like cliche. People say it all the time, but I'm a cancer. I'm really emotional. I mean it. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments. Let me know what else you want to see from me. I am 100% open to video and content suggestions. I'm 1000% open. Let me know in the comments down below. Uh, let me know what you think of this look. I will see you guys on Instagram because I know you about to go follow me after I beat my face like this. I just know you about to go follow me on Instagram. I know for a fact you are. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video, okay? Mucho besitas. Yeah. All you self-promoters are janky. We established like the Yankees. This whole fucking game thankless. We moving militant, but somehow you the one tanking. No limit to why I could take it. 
And you know me as a crisp bottle sender Check pick up or I thought we looked out for one another Saw us all as brothers in a struggle Too blessed to be humble I guess it's different in the city I come from All of a sudden I got people showing